In this video, we'll be looking into most repeated wild topic, topics for 2025 candidates. Give the video for topic 1, just comment on the comment section that you need the video for topic 1. Just type topic 1 and I'll send you the link for topic 1 video. Now let's look into this particular question so that it's going to help you. Please observe the way I will solve this question till the end and give you to share this video to your friends to your classmates let them learn as well okay so solution okay now for this ap let me give you three formulas these three formulas please you need it irrespective of any question that comes from ap these are the only three formulas we need to solve the question so the formula one is um, Tn, or you call it N, anyone, equals to A plus bracket N minus 1 G. Do most students know this formula? So, another formula I want to give is in terms of sum of it, that's Sn equals to 1 over 2N open bracket A plus N. Yeah, the N is number of terms, the Sn is sum of AP, the A, so like A is the first term, and the L, we are saying that is the last term. And the third formula I'll be giving is Sn equals to 1 over 2n open bracket a plus what is n? n is a plus n n is a plus open bracket n minus 1 close bracket d a plus n minus 1 close bracket d by the time you solve this that will be 1 over 2n open bracket 2a plus n minus 1 g he said the seventh term and the eighteenth term of an AP are what? 15 over 1 over 4 and 42 over 3 over 4. So now for the seventh term, that would be T7 equals to, now look at this, A, we don't know A, plus N, whereby N is what? 7. As you can see, it's a, N is 7 here. So if you put 7 here, and you don't know your d so this is going to be 8 plus 6 7 minus 1 is 6 8 plus 60 so this t7 is giving us 8 plus 60 from this expression a is it a n is 7 because it's 7 term you subtract it from 1 you have 6 this d this is it a. so that is that and they say the seventh term is what from the question is 15 whole number 1 over 4 so that is 61 Four. And then for your 18th term, so that would be T18 equals to what? A plus 17G. So that one is 42 whole number 3 over 4. 171 all over 4. 171 over 4. Now, having this question now, what are you going to do? Then we are going to solve it simultaneously because we have two unknown get so so this one will be a plus six g equals to sixty one over four, and also um a plus seventeen g equals to one seventy one over four. You can give this one the equation one. You can also give this one the equation two. So let's examine. Let's use elimination method. I think many can solve some of these equations. So by the time you subtract this minus this zero has gone six minus seventeen and that is what minus eleven d isn't it? Minus eleven d. So which one again then? Sixty one over four minus um this one over four minus one seventy one over four. That will give us minus four b a. Then if you do your sixty one minus uh, 171 that will give you around 110 yeah so that will give you around uh, 110 okay so that will be minus 110 so you can reduce the the two year is two two year is how many so from here you have five and from here that's 65 okay so you have it as minus 11 g equals to minus 55 all over 2 you can now divide the both side by 11 so dividing both side by sorry minus 11 right? minus 11 here divided by minus 11 over 1 
I'm just trying to show you the simplest way. Like I'm going as if you don't even know how to solve mathematics. Because if I'm solving this thing normally, I would have jumped so many steps. So this cancel this. Then our D. So our D is going to be minus 55 over 2 multiplied by 1 over what? Minus 11. I change this. So this one come up, some come up. So this cancel this. So 11 minus 1, 11 minus 5. And finally, my answer is 5 over 2. That's it. So the common difference is now, the common difference is 5 over 2. That is equivalent to 2 whole over 1 over 2 for the D. For me to substitute the value of D equals to 5 over 2 in any of the equations, I provide equation 1 or equation 2. Substituting D in for equation 1, whereby equation 1 is a plus 6d, which is equals to 61 over 4. So now our a is t over 1, whereby our d is now 5 over 2, equals to uh, 61 over what? 61 over 4. So 61 over 4. So therefore, so therefore, I can use all this, and this will be 2 year 1, 2 year 3. So if that is 3, then our A, then our A will be our A plus 3 times 5 will be 15, equals to 61 over 4. A equals to 61 over 4 minus 15. So solving this fraction, that will give us LCM is 4. Um, 4 in 4, 1, 1 times 61, 61 minus uh, 4 in 4, and four, um, one, 1 in 4 is 4, so times, uh, times uh, 15, that would be what, 60, so it is 60, but that we subtract, so that would be 1 over 4, so meaning that our, um, our first term is 1 over 4, so if our first term is 1 over 4, then what will be the nth term? Nth means like nth term means that you don't know the, you don't know that particular term. So now our nth term is on the that we are looking for for the a nth term. But we know that the formula is t n plus two a plus n minus one d. Whereby we don't know the t n bar. So the a that's the first term. That's one over four. For the plus open bracket, we don't know the n as I said, free for the n star, so that would be n minus 1 d, and the d is what 5 over 2, and what we got n now 5 all over 2. So we can now resolve this by saying tn equals to 1 over 4 plus, by the time we open this bracket, that would be 5 over 2, 5 n over 2 minus 5 over 2. Okay, now you can now solve fractions. A lot of fractions in this work. So tn equals to 1 over 4 minus 5 over 2 plus 5n over 2. So basically, you look for LCM as usual. So the LCM of this is what? The LCM of this is what? This is um, 4. 4 in 4, 1, 1 times 1, 1. Then this in this. 2 in 4, that is then 2 in 4, that is 2. 2 times 5, that is 10. Plus 5n over 2. That is t n. And finally, our nth term is going to be 5n over 2 minus 9 over 4. So when n, that is, when n is equal to 6. So we are, we are going to use this expression. We use this expression by saying t n equals to 5 n over 2 minus 9 over 4. And that will be 5 bracket 6 over 2 minus 9 over 4. You can say 2 year 1, 2 year 3. We'll be that very well. And that will be t 6. T 6. So that will be 5 times 3. That's 15 minus 1 over 1. Minus 9 over 4. If you resolve that fraction, the same is 4. 1 is 4, that's 4. 4 times 15, that is 
60 minus 4 is for 1, 1 times 9, 9. So finally, the answer will be 51 over 4. So 51 over 4 is going to be the sixth term. Sixth term. They like the first term is from our calculation. The first term is 1 over 4. The common difference is 5 over 2. Why the sixth term is 51 over 4? Thereby, the nth term, nth term means that we don't know what that particular term is. That one is 5n over 2 minus 9 over 4. Setting my next video on predicted questions, I mean likely questions, 99.9% .9 likely mathematics questions for my 2025. So that is my next video for you.